everybody and welcome to my channel. I'm Boo and this is my broski, Psyduck. I'm sure he'd love to say hello to you guys, but unfortunately the only way I can get him to speak is to spank him. So we just set that aside. We don't mess with- okay, okay, you guys wanna see it? You wanna say hi? I'm sorry, Psyduck. baby watermelons how are you guys doing i just drank like half of this mango monster so i am wired right now <laughs> and i was like wow perfect time to come home from work and film me a little video so here we are i just want to say the last time i looked at my subscriber count i was like below 8k subs and now we're almost at 10k so wow <laughs> for real, thank you guys so much for the support. It has been bananas. I swear, every time I make a video, I'm like, man, that was super weird. Why did you do that, boo? They're gonna find out that you're kind of a weirdo. But then it's like, you guys just keep coming back. <laughs> I don't know if I'm just a super weirdo or if you guys are super weirdos for liking my content, but uh, thanks. <laughs> I thought tonight would be an awesome night to test our luck with a couple of ETBs, baby. I have heard ultimate mixed reviews from these bad boys. Either they're like, so good, I pulled seven boss's orders out of one. You know what I mean? Like, I sacrificed my firstborn child for this ETB. <laughs> or people are like, this is trash. <laughs> So we're gonna put it to the test today. I only have two of these bad boys, but we also have a sword and shield ETB that I'll be opening as well. That I actually won in the tournament. I participated in this past week. That I actually went undefeated in, by the way. <laughs> So we're gonna open three of these bad boys and see what we can get. But first, I have some super exciting news. The Frost to Caribou channel has its first ever sponsorship, and that is Wonder Bread. You can buy your own sliced white bread. No, I'm <laughs> just kidding. I can't get you guys any discounts on white bread, but I can get you some spicy discounts on some white code cards. No, but actually Potown is a store that now sponsors my channel and I am so happy my first ever official sponsor. PTCGO, if you don't know, Pokemon Trading Card Game Online, horrible acronym, just saying. But they sell PTCGO code cards, so as you guys know, I don't give away my codes in my videos because I do play the online card game. But now I can give you guys 5% off code cards if you purchase from Potown with the code Pokeboom. So thank you so much to Potown for sponsoring my channel and believing in my content. And thank you to all my subscribers because I would not be here and have a sponsor for this channel without you supporting my work. So thank you so much. I appreciate you all. And I hope you guys enjoy the 5% off your code cards. Okay, my goose, let's get into opening these spicy ETBs. I hope they're spicy. Please be spicy. Yay! All right, you guys, we're starting with this Sword and Shield ETB because it is older than the Rebel Clash ETBs. So here we go. Start with this big boy. I'm a huge fan of this cool shaping they did with the box. I thought that was kind of creative. So here we go. ETB action. I'm just gonna skip everything that's in here because you guys probably already know what's in here and we gonna go straight for these packs. That boss's order is our goal card today. We're not gonna find that in Sword and Shield base set. Uh, that's gonna be in the Rebel Clash boxes, but from Sword and Shield, I kind of want, uh, I guess a Zamazenta Seeker Rare. We still have not pulled that, so that'd be sick. All right, here we go. Metal Energy, Haunter, Vitality Band, Scorpi, Hutoot, Score Bunny, Pikachu, Sinistee, Roserade, Reverse Hollow, and... <gasps> oh, starting off with some V action, baby. What up, Reggie Rock? How you doing? It's been a long while. I remember pulling like 1,800 of you. And now you're back at it again. <laughs> oh, and also, 
Casual reverse holo rare. Oh, baby. That was a solid pack for our first pack. So I won this ETB at a tournament I went to. I was playing Baby Blacephalon, my go-to deck nowadays. I love my baby bees. It's going to be totally useless after rotation, so I got to play it while it lasts. Sobble, reverse holo, Maractus the Cactus, my cutie. For a second, I thought Maractus the Cactus was related to, to Rose Raid, but... I was wrong, disregard, and <gasps> Sandaconda non-holographic, so green pack for us. Honestly, I feel like a good ETB is like, what, like half white packs is a good ETB, I think. Snom, Mullawile, Gossiflower, Goldeen, Diglett, Boy, Slizzipede, Sizzlypede, Reverse Hollow, and <gasps> Durant, Durant non-holographic for that big boy. So yeah, the more white packs, the better. Of course, maximum power of good pulls, <laughs> Pikachu. Reverse Hollow and Nine Tails. Yo, that's what's up. That's another Reverse Hollow rare. And it's beautiful. And. <gasps> oh, God. Oh, God. So far, this ETP is. Uh, ooh, Fist Bump Energy, Crushing Hammer. It's okay. I guess. Could be better. Could be worse. I don't want to curse the rest of the packs here. Silly Cobra. <gasps> reverse Hello Rare. Wow, I'm getting so many Reverse Hello Rares lately, and I'm I'm here for it. And <gasps> Lantern, non-holographic. Three packs left, and we have three Reverse Hello Rares. So even though we've only had two white packs, technically they've all been white packs because... We got reverse hall rares for all of them. That's pretty crazy. Let's see if we can keep it up with either another white pack, eyeball energy, or another reverse hall rare. That'd be sick, grooky, sable. Maybe it's just like these new sword and shield sets. They're putting more reverse hall rares or something. No way. Oh, okay, that's not. Oh well, we broke the streak. Ripperoni, <laughs> Galarian, Lanoon, and. <gasps> Drampa the Grandpa! Non-holographic Drampa the Grandpa, though, unfortunately. Last two packs, you guys. Man, this is going so quick. I feel like I'm so used to uh, booster box openings that I'm like, whoa, 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 slow it down, booby. <laughs> <laughs> Lulu, reverse holo switch. Yo, that is what's up. I love it. And <gasps> oh, Del Mize V card. Okay, so it's a regular V, but I mean, it's not nothing. So we got two V cards so far. That's like a pretty average ETB, I think. That's that's not too bad. And then of course the reverse holo trainer card, which is absolutely sick. It's funny because the full art boss's orders is actually more expensive than the rainbow one, which is kind of hilarious. Uh, but it's because that one generally just looks nicer. It's cooler. Like, everybody loves Giovanni. He looks like a total mob boss. Looks like he's either going to break my kneecaps or teach me his recipe for spicy Italian subs. I don't know. <laughs> Goldine. Diglett Burroughs. Gotta be. Hoot hoot. Ooh, reverse hollow sinistry and <gasps> Grandpa the Grandpa! Oh man, we can't get away from grandpas today, you guys. So that was our first ETB. Honestly, that wasn't that bad. We got two V card pulls, which is sick. A bunch of reverse holo rares, a holographic berserker nightmare fuel, and a reverse holo trainer, which I'm always about damn reverse holo trainer, baby. Oh, so pretty. If you guys didn't know, this is like my favorite color. So I'm automatically in love with the color of this box. I think it's so pretty. Not a huge fan of Kaparaja as a Pokemon. I don't know what it is. He just looks like a mess to me. <laughs> like this doesn't look like a Pokemon or an elephant to me. It looks like uh, some sort of steam factory. <laughs> Man, these packs feel like super loose. Like opening that pack felt really loose for some reason. Fireball energy, beware, speed energy. Pelly Pepper, like, I don't know what it was. The Sword and Shield packs were super tight, and these are, like, not at all. Nose Pass, Reverse Holo Clefairy, and <gasps> Gyarados Holographic for that one. So it is a white pack, but nothing super spicy. I'm, like, freaked out that these might be resealed packs for some reason. Like, that, it looks kind of sketch. It feels really loose. Uh. I can't remember where I got these boxes from. I think they were from Wally World, but I'm not 100% sure. 
sure about that, but we'll see, I guess. Little Timmy, oh. All right, now I feel a little bit better because I saw little Timmy's cute little face. Reverse hollow squovet and... <gasps> Oh, never mind. Never mind. It's not rigged. Uh, this is not resealed. <laughs> Yo, what in the world? Why is that one of the most beautiful cards I've ever seen in my life? Dude, I love his little T-Rex arms. He's just like... <laughs> I guess these packs are just really loose for some reason, but I mean, so far we have two white packs, a hollow and a full art Dragapult, so I will take it. I will take it. Aracuda, Glaring Mouth, Surskit, Magikarp, my baby boy. Ow! Morgrem, uh, ooh, that's a rare? No, it's not. My bad. Morgrem Reverse Hollow, and... Oh my god! What? Bro! Oh my gosh! Dude! Secret Rare, Frostmoth, and the Full Art Dragonfall. Bro, now everyone's gonna think I rigged these packs. Nah. <laughs> this is absolutely insane. A secret rare and a full art from an ETB. That very, very rarely happens. Never have I ever seen such a good ETB, baby. Man, I'm so happy I fell on the uh, good luck portion of the people opening <laughs> Rebel Clash ETBs. Galarian Farfetch, Reverse Hollow Wingle, and... <gasps> oh, creamy. So dreamy. I love that card! Oh, Creamy is such a cute Pokemon. That was a non-holographic though, so green pack for us. The rest of these might be green packs. Fist Bump Energy Baby, because we just pulled uh, like two of the best cards we probably could have pulled out of this box. So I am happy about that. No complaints here. Heracross, Reverse Hollow, and <gasps> Obama's No! Non-holographic for that. Three packs, we might have some good luck. Fireball, energy, speed energy, Metapod, Surskit, Magikarp, boo, boo, boo. Milk Ball, Growth, Reverse Hollow, Siglyph, that is a rare for us, Reverse Hollow, and oh my goodness! Dude, dude. Okay, okay, so we have a holographic, a Reverse Holo rare, uh, an Inteleon V, just a casual V card, and then, of course, our secret rare and a full art V pull as well. This is probably officially one of the best ETBs I have ever opened. Rebel Clash has treated me so poorly and then so well at the same time. Like, we have this love-hate relationship that I can't let go of. Baby boy, so cute. Mass mass grain? I don't know if I'm saying that correctly. I feel like I'm not, but he looks like a grampy berry. <laughs> and then last but not least, <gasps> Electivire non-holographic. I'm not lying to you guys though. All of those packs felt ooh, fist bump energy. Could it be good luck? All of those packs felt really, really loose to me. Like, I don't know if they, maybe it's from a different factory or something. I know some of them come from overseas. I know there's a big printing, like, Pokemon factory, I guess, in Texas. So, I don't know. Sometimes they come from different places and they just feel, they feel weird. <laughs> <laughs> Mandy Buzz, yo, that is a reverse hollow rare, you guys, rolling in them today. And last but not least, oh my gosh, one of the best V cards in this set that everybody is in awe over because of how good this ability is. It's low key a Dedenne GX, but in a V card. Uh, and with a different ability, of course, as well. Look at these ETBs! I cannot believe we pulled a Secret Rare and a Full Art Dragapult from a freaking ETB, and I thought they were rigged. I, I legitimately thought we were just gonna pull trash. I think the reason I was so suspect about uh, these two Rebel Clash ETBs is because I'm pretty sure I got them from Amazon, and one time I ordered from Amazon and I actually had like a super rigged ETB, but that one wasn't even wrapped now that I think about it. Like these were shrink wrapped, they weren't in the Pokeball shrink wrap, but they were at least shrink wrapped where the other one wasn't even wrapped. It was just like, here's your ETB. And it was so rigged, it wasn't even funny, man. Like these were totally like glued back together. I mean, sometimes people can reseal packs and like make it look legit. I'm not really sure how they do that, if it's just with like hot glue or something, but sometimes it looks legit. 
you know, and I would totally miss it. So I feel like these being so loose just kind of scared me. Oh, these ones aren't as loose though. Okay, okay. This might be a, a trashy TB then. <laughs> because it's not as loose. <laughs> All right, our third and final ETB for the night. Starting off with a Black Mamba energy, baby. I will take it. Sir Skit, Magic Boy, Baby Boy, Milk Ball. What is with this, you guys? It goes Magic Baby, Baby Baby, and then Milk Ball. That is like always the order. And then Growth. Oh my gosh. What the heck? is happening reverse hollow galarian mr rhyme that is a reverse hollow rare stacking it up on our collection and oh oh my goodness my favorite yes i never pulled him before oh he's so pretty yes. oh my gosh my beautiful double i talked about this cutie in the last video i had yet to pull him but we got him, you guys! The full art double. I absolutely love this card. It's actually a really good card in the TCG as well. It doesn't have a deck based around only this card. This is more like a card that you just like pop out at the end and he hits for like an exponential amount of damage. So he is fantastic in the TCG and I just love that beautiful yellow background that he has. Oh, he makes me so happy. Wow, you guys, and I just said that this ETB wasn't going to be as good as the last. I think I was more hyped about that than I was about the Secret Rare Frost Moth, like, if we're being real. <laughs> that just shows you guys how much I prioritize cute cards over anything, okay? Cute cards are the best. Look at that. Magikarp, Baby Boy, Milk Ball, Growth. What is this? What is this sorcery? I cannot believe we keep getting that combo. It's weirding me out. And reverse Hello Talk, Solo Grumpy Boy, and <gasps> Mandy Buzz non holographic. Okay, I was I was thinking that might be another good pack because it was the exact same combo, but I guess not. I don't know. For real though, if I see that combo one more time, it's it's really weird. Have you guys noticed that? It's weirding me out. Applin, Hatina, Atacuda, Galernial, the Reverse Hollow Bronzer, and oh my gosh, Dragapult V. This is the regular art. My boy chilling with his cute little baby boys. See, now I feel bad for all the people that were like, yo, don't open the ETBs. Fist bump energy, baby. People have been telling me these ETBs are trash. I should not open them. I actually haven't even bought an ETB. Uh, aside from these, I've been waiting to open these for a video. And I was like, bro, I'm not even going to buy ETBs because like everyone's saying they're absolute trash. But now, now look at this. We're getting reverse hell galler mines, boys and grills. All day, all night, and... <gasps> Ooh, and a holographic Galarian Weezing. So that is another white pack for us. All of these packs have had something to offer, whether it's like a reverse holo rare or a reverse holo trainer or a freaking spicy V pole. That's bananas. I could not be happier right now, my goobs. Going into this fireball energy. Lampent, Amber Damp. Shinx, oh my gosh, can I please get better? Stunky, <gasps> Reverse Holo Dan, the creepiest card I've ever seen. And we just got his Reverse Holo, woo! <laughs> and last but not least, oh, my Snorlax! Non-holographic Snorlax boy, but still a cutie. Woo, I will take these packs. As many as you can give me. Eyeball Energy, Curse Shovel, Grubbin, Wingle Natu, Barbot, Squovit. Oh, another one! Another one! <laughs> Reverse Hollow, Cursed Shovel, and. Oh my god! Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? The Brows! Yo, what is this? How did we just pull two Dragapults? out of the same ETV. What in the world? We still have two packs left, you guys. Oh my goodness. So let's just crack open these packs right here, starting with our Rila Boom. Rila Boom! I was actually really sad when no one commented on my Donkey Kong uh, N64 joke in my last video. I was, I was pretty disheartened. I was like, oh man, has no one played that game? <laughs> 
reverse hollow. Coughing, tooting it up, and... Oh, my bad, sorry. <laughs> Wait, that wasn't a reverse hollow. All right, you guys, you can't even blame me for that. The reverse hollow dark Pokemon are really hard to see, so I just miscounted in my head. I thought that was the reverse hollow, but no. The reverse hollow is this Voltorb. And last but not least, <gasps> Caesar, non holographic. All right, you guys, this is the last pack in this ETB. Honestly, this has been a solid. ETB, that'd be sick if we could clutch it up with another white pack. So let's see, Phantom, reverse holo Timmy! <gasps> Yay! Oh my gosh, I don't remember getting a reverse holo Timmy, so this might be our first one. And last but not least, the last card of this video. <gasps> oh! Creepy sarcophagus, dude. <laughs> hey, but at least we got this reverse holo Timmy. Okay, my little Hot Pockets, thank you so much for coming to this video. I appreciate you sticking with me through these three ETBs. I am not disappointed. I'm so happy with these ETBs. I feel terrible for anyone that has had horrible luck with ETBs because these were exceptionally good and I feel really lucky right now. So thank you, Pokemon gods. I love you. Thank you to all of my Patreon peeps who support this channel. You guys are the absolute best, my MVP bros. And maybe, just maybe, Next time I talk to you guys, we will have hit that 10k milestone, which is, woo, that's crazy. Sometimes I just look at my subscriber counts and I just start hyperventilating. <laughs> I appreciate you guys so much and it means a lot to me that you value my content that I make. So thank you, my subscribers. I would not be here without you. And until next time, my goobers, I'm gonna go play Ragnarok and I will catch you guys on the flip side. Burr, 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 burr.